Hello everyone, before I get into anything in this video, the thumbnail, the Burger vs Super Saiyan Rose YouTube, that was made by Sonic Matthews, I'll put a link to his YouTube channel down in the description of this video, go show him some love, he actually has a few with messages videos uploaded to his channel, so I'm sure you guys will enjoy that, but with that being said, let's get on to today's video. So what I will do for this video is I just want to give a bit of a channel update and what I have planned for the future of this channel going forward in 2018. But before I do get into that, I just need to mention two things. Firstly, thank you guys for the incredible support you've been showing the channel so far in 2018. And secondly, something that's like a bit serious but not really, but that is sub boxes on YouTube. I did mention this in a previous live stream which I've now made private, but long story short, for about the past three or four weeks, like basically like the past month, let's just say that, sub boxes and notifications on YouTube haven't been working properly. Now this happens every so often, but it's been happening now for, well I'd say the past three weeks to be more accurate. Um, but I'd say like the past five or so days, again as of when this video is uploaded, they've been really, really bad. But it's not just been bad for me, it's been bad for Steed OJ, Super Saiyan Kabi 28, and apparently from Kabi, the Black Sun Goku, and DB Zenkai as well. So that's five people in, in like the Xenoverse 2 slash fighters community. But outside of the fighters and Xenoverse community, this has been affecting YouTubers across the board. I've actually been talking to someone over on Twitter who has 3.1 million subscribers and they've been telling me, yeah, something's up. I do think they're a bit better today. I'm not entirely sure. I mean, I guess this video will be a bit of a test, who knows? But what I'm trying to get here is you may have missed videos from me and from some of the other people that you watch. So make sure you go check the channels out in case you have missed videos from them. And to turn on the notification bell and then select all in terms of when you get notified. And just follow us on Twitter and now my Instagram which is at Dandelion. Because I will be posting stuff there as well. But one final note about this. If this is happening to you as well and you're angry. Don't. Surprisingly enough. You shouldn't do this. Don't direct your hate towards YouTube. Because. Okay. So. Long story short. If sub boxes aren't working. That means a video gets less views. Meaning. Less ads are played on it. Which ultimately means. Less money is made from the video. Now if you don't know this. YouTube takes. I believe. It's 45% of your ad revenue earnings. So, long story short, if the videos aren't being sent out properly, that means less people watch it, meaning YouTube also makes less money. So they're not doing this on purpose. The problem comes from the fact that YouTube is a behemoth of a website. They just can't take it down for like maintenance because it would, well, probably kill quite a few channels and they would just earn nothing. And given that YouTube now is like a stream, well, a video streaming uh, platform, you know, like website, um, movie website, music, and recently, you know, TV, they simply cannot take it down. It'll be like taking down uh, Google for a day, like, you just wouldn't do it. Uh, so yeah, that's what I have to say about that. So moving on to plans I actually have for the channel. Well, I say plans, it's more or less going to be the same, but very quickly, I do want to talk about Dragon Ball Z Dolphin Battle. So, Lately, I've just found myself logging in there less and less. Nothing against the game, it's just that I just don't have that much time for it and I don't really feel that motivated to log in. I do know right now on the JP version, it's the third year anniversary and I think the third year anniversary for Global comes out in like, what? June or July, I want to say? Maybe May, somewhere around there, like May, June, July. Yeah, where we get like a new Dragon Ball game announcement, which I'll talk about later as well. But what, what I think I may do is I may just like either buy or start saving my stones and get like at least 1,000 dragon stones and when the global third year anniversary comes around I may just do one final video trying to pull LR Vegeta and LR Gogeta and that will be like my, you know, my Dragon Ball Z Dark and Battle finale video. But I'm not entirely sure yet, I mean I'm, if I do, look I think I'm going to do this anyway because I think that will be fun to do. Um, but honestly, there's no, like, I know Super Saiyan 3 Brody has came over now to Global. But apart from that, especially given Super's ending, I just don't really care for Dolkin Battle that much anymore. I mean, this could change whenever, so I'm probably not going to do another Dolkin Battle video until then. And when I do do that video, that's probably going to be my last one. But we'll have to wait and see, really. I mean, whenever I do a lot of Dolkin video, I get people saying, Oh, I never knew you did Dolkin videos, which that's fine, but... Yeah, like as of right now, like when this video is uploaded, I have, I believe it's 23 Dark and Battle videos, so maybe I should round it up to 25 and end it there, I don't know. 
And we're talking about like, I guess like, series that I have on the channel in the background. Next, just very briefly, the Q&A series. Now with the Q&A series, I do like the idea of that. And it's something that I want to do permanently, but it's in the background, so... I may only, yeah, I may do one once every month, every two months, whatever. But the third one, I have no date for as of right now. That could change whenever. But when I do that, I will post something over on the channel's community tab that I'm doing a third Q and A, and to leave questions here. Look, how did like the first and second one, I believe. So again, guys, if you do want, you know, to ask a question, you know, feel free to save it for then and then post it there, and I will, you know, hopefully answer it in a future Q and A video. So moving on to Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 and Dragon Ball Fighters now. Yeah, pretty much going to continue the same to be honest. Uh, well, I'll say the same, like I'm going to keep doing those videos. I, I think this will be the final time I'm going to mention this, but the only time I'm going to stop doing my Xenoverse 2 videos is when Dragon Ball Xenoverse 3 is actually released, and um, whether that will be. At this point, it's just a question of when, not if now. Like Xenoverse has just done so well that it would be ludicrous not to do a third installment. Think of it as in, you know, not doing Budokai Tenkaichi 3 after the success of the Budokai Tenkaichi series back on the PS2. Like at this point, it's a question of when, not if. Um, yeah, and I've been doing the facecam videos lately, and well, firstly, again, just thank you ever so much for the incredible support you guys have been showing on the facecam videos. It's honestly really great to see that you guys are digging those. Um, yeah, look, going forward, well, as of right now, I've got three videos, like two Xenoverse 2 videos and one Fighters video that I recorded before I stopped the facecam videos. I may scrap those, I'm not entirely sure yet, but facecam is something that I want to do pretty much permanently going forward, even though it's not in this video because I just don't think it'll be... I don't, well, for this video, I don't think it's needed, to be honest, so that's why it's not here. Um, yeah, I do plan on getting the green screen. I'm just waiting for the El Gato green screen to come back in stock because right now it's not in stock because it's like incredibly cheap for what it is and it's portable and it's extremely high quality. So I'm waiting for that to come back in. And when you know I do get that, of course, I'll use that immediately. But for the time being, you know, I just don't have a green screen. So I will do stuff like work around that. Um, now with Universe 2, the funny moment videos and the message videos I have zero of either of those recorded, but I've not. Well, it's not as if I'm stopping doing them. Stopping doing that's great grammar, isn't it? It's not as if I've stopped doing them. It's just that I've not got any more recorded. Now I made a decision about. Well, after the I believe it was the Times Five Present for You Tron video part one or part two. I can't remember which one. But I made a decision to wait until at least DLC six to do the next 20 moment videos and I mentioned in the live stream that I did uh, a few days ago again as of when this video is uploaded what the next times free trailer video will be I'm not going to mention it here because if you don't know it may be a nice surprise but it's going to happen at some point after DLC 6 is released for Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 and again the message videos no plans on stopping them but I've just had no no one message me um, you know, or not rather no hate messages um, and I think that's because I don't know what I don't know what's happened, and again I've mentioned this in the live stream as well. But if you type in on PSN Burkol B U R C O L, my PSN is nowhere to be found, and I have absolutely no idea why. I've not changed my settings, and I've checked my settings various times now, probably like a few dozen, to make sure that they're you know set to public. I've even asked like PSN or of like uh, like the PlayStation support networks you know, what's happened here, and they can't help me, they have no idea what the hell's happened. If anyone does know how to fix this, do let me know, because regardless of like the message videos aside, like, I have a PSN community, the Burko community, and I've noticed that there's been less people requesting to join because they can't find my PSN, that's how I, you know, I've said, if you want to join the community, just type in my PSN, and go to my PSN profile, and find, you know, just scroll down to the Burko community, and click on request to join. Plus, I can't get invites anymore unless I fr you know, friend people, which that's not a big deal, but basically it's not working as intended and I don't like it, so I do want to get this fixed as soon as possible. Yeah, but again, because of that, I'm just getting less messages, which I mean, it's kind of like a blessing, I guess, maybe, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, fighters videos, very quickly, the Road to Super Saiyan Blue, I think that's going to be, well, I think the Road to Super Saiyan Blue and maybe the Fiend Team videos, I think those are going to be like the two main sorts of fighters, at least PvP videos I'm going to be doing in the future. But again, we'll have to wait and see, I may drop something or pick, you know, start a new series or whatever, I don't know. But guys, I think that's pretty much it. Long story short, sub boxes don't work properly, uh, turn on notifications and facecam videos will stay, whatever, I don't know. 
Uh, guys, with that being said, thank you ever so much for listening to me ramble for like, what, 10 minutes now? Um, with that being said, thank you again for watching. I do hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time.